Barrel Gangster Waves, a.k.a. O.T.D. A.k.a. Mr. Answer Right Jack, a.k.a. Champ. Yo, gunplay. Gunplay. Huh. Gunplay was arrested for upping the toolie on his baby mother. Now, 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 this is what happened. Allegedly, I don't, because I wasn't there. I just, this is what I heard well, in the media. That gunplay was playing. The thing is, I guess the, the guy's about the game. Playing a game. And you know, when a person gets so caught up into the game, how you get to cussing and making all that noise, yelling and stuff. You got a baby. Your mother come to me, man, baby, you make too much noise to wake the baby up. So I'm playing, trying to hit that. He on the game, cutting up. We don't know what he's full of. He had to be full of something, up, totally. You know, other two don't really love one unless you're under influence. That's what might have happened. He might have been under influence. I don't know what he could have been under influence of, so don't be telling my what you think. You know, you think he was on whatever. But she took the social media and wrote her little letter saying, you know, everything all right, the baby, her and the baby okay, blah, blah, blah. So, you know what, you know what, you know what, you know what? I thought about this. Under no circumstances do you up a toolie on no innocent person. Period. I don't care how much y'all clowning, playing, looking at the game, whatever you, whatever it is. And this is your baby mother, and a baby around, whatever. This is your child. Who you love? Who you would die for? So the crazy part about it is, once you do what you do, then the baby mama take the social media. So that's gonna make it even worse. Cause now people are gonna be reading what she talking about, and, you, and, you, and they're like, "Boy, he done bad. He wrong. What was he? Was, he was high. Was Rick Ross needs to go get him. Get him man, what, what's going on, man? What's going on with the MMG family over there? What it is? Maybach music. Oh man, whatever it is. Um, that it is MMG, right? What the MB yeah MB, uh, MG Maybach Maybach MB y'all know what it is to help me out so um but yeah so I'm like when I heard this I'm like man you know it's good to see when the person out the way chilling you know at home staying out the way but it's bad when you at home. And you get in trouble at home too. So it's like, you know, some people like, man, I'm going home so I can stay out of trouble, man. I'm going to be at home, play my little game. I'm out, y'all, we're about everybody, we're about it. So you're at home and get in trouble, go to jail. Man, what's going on, y'all? What did this world turn to? This man at home, staying out the way, staying out of trouble, playing a game, and get in trouble at home. And go to jail. I want to see bond them out. You know you gotta. Did you see out yet, y'all? Did they recover the toolie? See, it's the thing I gotta look into. I gotta check this out. You know what I'm saying? Somebody, y'all, now y'all be knowing a lot too, but y'all nosy. So send it to me. Even send me the comment. Yo, yeah, yeah, so, so got this. Or yeah, y'all know how it go, man. Send that stuff to me. But um. I just was like, man, what was, like, you know, once you come down, if you high, once you come down and you realize, man, I did that goof stuff, did I really do that? You know, one thing we do know, you strap. I ain't gonna play with gunplay. Hundred in that drum. Ba 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 bam. I used to love that song when I was in the when I was locked up, man. He used to go hit over that song. Man, that song, that oh yeah. I can't think of the name of it, dude. I can hear you know how y'all had that rhythm. You know, that rhythm. I know he is. How he, I want to say Rick Ross on that with him, but I think he on that by himself. I know y'all don't know say hundred in a drum. It got that man. It got that hard. It got that beat. That beat ride too, man. 
But anyway, um, are you guys are fans of Gunplay. Uh, was he part of Carrot City Cartel? Well, he was a soldier, but anyway, I know next time he might have a tool to put up somewhere. Because it ain't cool to, if a person's drinking or getting high, it's not cool to have that tool right there while you play that game, because that game gets you your feelings. I don't, I don't understand it, though. I really don't. I guess because I don't know how to play it. But guess what, y'all? Now that I think about that, I bought me a PlayStation 5. And I bought an actual controller. I haven't hooked it up yet. And then Sweet People hating on me. That's my homie. He got a, he got a PlayStation 4, so you know he hate Because I got the 5. He got the 4. That stuff on. So, oh, oh, you're going to need me to hook it up. So, I won't do this. I won't put my pride to the side and ask him. So I haven't hooked the game up. When I hook the game up, I want to play Call of Duty. That's right. I'm going to get me a team. I'm going to play Call of Duty. So whoever got it out there, we're going to hook up. We're going to play Call of Duty. The minute I do something wrong, y'all get the first time I hold it, I'm, I'm going to delete y'all. I'm going to kick y'all out the, out the day. Can I do that? I don't want to be in control of who all I let in, or, you know, and whatever, the higher we go. When we hook up, you dig. That's right. We're going to play Call of Duty, y'all. That's what we're going to play. Yeah, we're going to play. So we're going to get that together. We're going to get all the squad together. We're going to play Call of Duty. Now, I'm telling y'all, I do not gamble. So don't be telling me all that play for some money, OG. And that, no, I do not gamble. So don't come ask me that. I just want to have some fun with the game. So let's hook up. And let's play the Call of Duty. That's it. But not right now because I don't have it hooked up. I have it, but I don't have it hooked up. Still in the box. Brand new. And I got the good one. I don't have them. The one where you just download. I had a one that go with you, with you, with you, with you, with you, where you can put the disc and you can download. That's right. I got the expensive one. Well, it wasn't expensive when I bought it though. But you know how people try to knock y'all head off today. They be down bad. I be here. How they be uh, selling those things. Go to the store, get them on the low, and then sell them for the high. But anyway, I got one. Yeah, I got one, y'all. I have one. Yep, 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 yep. So, Get the team together. I don't know how many people can play at one time, but we're gonna get us a squad together and we're playing Call of Duty. That's right. Cause you know, that's the only time I can tour the two. So I'm gonna have some fun on that. Do they got drinks and F and N's and all that? I know they got grenades on the flash, so I'm gonna be I'm gonna be cutting up. The rocket lumber, man, listen, I might be hitting people on my team. I'm gonna wipe them out too. I'm gonna be I'm gonna be so happy I'm, I'm on that but you did. So y'all get ready. It's going down. We're going to play Call of Duty. Yeah, that's what we're going to do. Man, listen. Y'all know my motto. Let's save no drug. Let's stop the violence. Put the guns down. Make sure y'all can test for HIV and AIDS. Y'all need to know y'all's status. I got the nine profit they need. I got the instrument in this third war. I got the movie. Boys at War. Yep, yep, yep. Uh, Eric, Ava. Love y'all. Hank, what's Sam, baby? Yep, 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 yep. Phone gate, bro, you better chill out too. Anyway, um, somebody else I said I wanted to shout out. Shout out to Flash, shout out to uh, 504 Fat Girl Cookie. And shout out to Motivational Mike. Sweet Pete, Boat, Sweet Old Head, Sweet Pete, just did 33. That's what I'm gonna get on, that's what I'm gonna do the interview with next, Sweet Pete. The old hill, my connect. Remember, I told y'all that story when I went to Ghost up back there in Holly Grove, me and my homeboy Lou, and we went in this bar with these two guys, and one gave me some heroin, and the other one gave him some weed, and, and then he had that 40, and we almost got into it. And that was one of my connects, but well, he home. After 30 something years, he home. That's right, he home. I'm gonna talk. I was like, man, he said, yeah, you need to let me come on the podcast so I can talk about the Supreme Court and the, and the, and the Senate where they got the hundred this and this and this. And I'm listening to it. I'm like, man, my people don't want to hear nothing about that, man. You tripping. You from the old school, cold gangster from Holly Grove. And you talking about you want to come on the channel and talk about some politics and something. Man, get out of here. I, I almost hung up. I ain't hang up, yo, because I'm happy to hear from y'all. But I almost hung up on him, bro. That's right. Sweep you out to Holly Grove. Man, thank y'all for all the love and support. I'm out. Gunplay. Get yourself together, brother. Wow.